Hi everyone, it is me, Jordan Long here, and today I'm going to talk about hanging out with the Joker. And I know that's probably out of all the followers of the 4 1 Bonds of Evil, you're not anyone you should be hanging out with. Yes, he's a sinner, yes, he's an outlaw. There, some folks say there's an unlikeness between the two. Yes, yeah, some stuff, some things are sin, some things are both sinful and unlawful, and some things are not. But I think he would also be a fear striker, too. Well, so you picked to hang out with me today. Yeah, not because I thought it would be a good thing or not. Well, you do know. And I should tell you this, in the TWF, I think it was like last year or the year before that, I got a throw out win over Batman or Wildermouse Man. Yeah. Yeah, and we all know your yesteryear. You first came, and <clears throat> the first time we got you was in 25th Between YL from Big Lots, this small toy. Or need be, yeah. There may be even been a smaller one from five and below. Oh, and like last year, I think. You know, last year, I think, we got you. I think last year, a year before that, I think you came from Walmart. Well, no, it was last year. And a lot of folks always wonder what, would I, what I am. Yes, I'm a sinner. Yes, I'm an outlaw. Yes, you would also be a fear striker, too. How do you think I would be a fear striker? Because you kidnap, you slay, you blow up things. So you go way above what most sinners, shifted outlaws would do. You do what many things would call a fear striker. And why do you do the sinful, unlawful things you do? Well, none of the books, none of the films, none of the shows ever really give you a back saga to why you do the things you do. Well, I would think that some of the books and some of the films and some of the shows do. Oh yeah. Well, I guess so. They don't make any of them right. Even if something bad happened to you in your past, choosing to be sinful and choosing to be unlawful is never the answer to anything. Well, don't get me wrong, all men and women are sinners, yes. But very few of them go from being sinners to outlaws. Yeah. You do know that that I that I cast myself as a clown. Yeah, I know. It's not bad enough. You got to be a sinner and an outlaw and a fear striker. You got to besmirch clowns too. You got to give them a bad name. Hey, I chose to be a clown because my sinful unlawful deeds are mostly played as a stunt or lark yeah well that's funny because no one's never laughing about any other things you do you like to go around and your saying or one of your many sayings is why so earnest as almost if oh yeah i did this sinful thing i did this unlawful thing i fear striked i did this i did that Oh, I'm a thief, I'm a slayer, I'm a kidnapper, I'm a fear striker. I do all these sinful and unlawful things, and half of those I just said are sinful and unlawful. But oh, don't take it so earnest. It's only a stunt and lark. And you know, I am one of the unlooked followers of the four one bonds of evil. First off, no one who is a follower of the four one bonds of evil is unlooked. Feared? Yes. Unlooked? No. Uh, so I don't really think at the end of the day anyone onlooks you. Some fear you. 
Some hate you, but I don't think anyone onlooks you. I think some folks feel sorry for you, that you chose a life of sin and a life of misdeed, that you chose to become a sinner and an outlaw and a fear striker and I guess a slayer and a kidnapper and a thief and who knows what else sinful and unlawful deeds you did. But I do know one thing, God and Jesus love and God and Jesus forgive everyone of every sinful and lawful deed they did even if mankind and womankind are not so forgiving of it but you got to choose to know that you did wrong and you got to choose to atone for your wrongs I can't make you do it that's your own free will you got that right it's my own free will and I guess I'm more fun to hang out with than would say Calistro yeah, well, Calistro's got her back saga and back tail, too. So that's me hanging out with the Joker. Well, we know the word joke is a Latin borrowed word or a French borrowed word. The English word would be stunt or lark. And what would you call one who plays a stunt and lark? Well, that's hard to say. Because you could say stunner, but that's more like talking about a gun who freezes someone or someone gets stunned, they're frozen. So you really can't say it wouldn't be the right word for it. You know, a stunt? Again, yeah, I guess you could say, or a lark. There is no, yeah, but once you put ER in the, in the, in, 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 at the end of the English word stunt, it gets a new meaning then. So yeah, it would be stunt, it would be lark. If you like this film, follow me over here at the Jordan Long Fairway. Watch the other film I made yesterday over here, my hangout with Calistro. Which I don't know if she's any more greater than the Joker. Or mankind. Anyway, I Jordan Long and I'll see you later. Bye.